<laughs> well, folks, fat is back, lard dripping suet. Politically incorrect, but it's here to stay. Please welcome the authors of Cooking with Fat, Craig Preston and Pat Shield. <laughs> Oh, golly, um, this is a big thing of pork. Has the rabbi left? <laughs> <laughs> he um, saw it on the way out. He did? He and did. His, his reaction would he be... He loved it. He was delighted. He's he, a terrific bloke, the rabbi. Wonderful guy. <laughs> he was now, thrilled. guys, excuse me. Fat is back. This is cooking with fat, but, I mean, it's a very slim book for a fat book. Well, we're about, we're about to cook with some it's fat. Hot. Oh, hot, hot, it's highly hot. concentrated. <laughs> this is the raw pure fat, carry on. Okay, some of the recipes you've got in here are quite vile. We are talking... <laughs> what are you doing with that Just thing? <laughs> uh, what have we got? We've got stuffed camel, frog soup, jellied mousse. Yep. What, where did you get all these recipes from? Well, a great deal of research. Um, what we found was... What we found was that any cookbook... What is that? that what is that? Lard, Kerry. It's that lard. That is lard? lard. We're going to cook with some of this. Mm -mm. We found that any cookbook from before 1970 was no good. Yeah. So most of the stuff from the 30s. And the... Yeah. Okay, Colette, I mean, are you saying for let, forget the cholesterol? We were, to we're told in 1997 that you can't have all this stuff. Don't worry about it. Not a problem. Yeah. Life is too short to worry about that sort of thing. You're not... Yeah. <laughs> Life will be very short. Doesn't this stuff yeah, but, kill you? But what's it matter if you have a really good time when you're out there? Now, do you want a hand with it? Have we got, oh, yeah. have we got the tonnage with that? Yeah, I'm moving out of here. <laughs> Anyhow. Be careful, guys. I don't like blood We're on We're going to heat up some lard here and hopefully we're going to be able to fry some bread and hand it out to the audience. Oh, fried uh, bread as well. Bread? You guys had some fried bread, huh? Who would like, yeah. oh, Who would like to eat bread. something really fatty? Okay. Now, um, you also include in here... You also include, what is it, Siberian martinis and suet... Margaritas. Margaritas. What a great Ooh. drop. Oh. Suet margaritas. OK, what's in a suet margarita? I give up. Is this good crackling? It's fantastic. We thought we might serve some up. OK. Can we pop some out to the audience? Yes. yes. Oh, yes, indeed. We've got a few little plates and things like that. Excuse me, Karen. I'm, I'm just a bit lardy here, but it is good for the hands. Mm -hmm. So what's a suet margarita? Well, it's basically an ordinary, an ordinary margarita, and rather than rolling the glass in the salt at the top, you run a bit of suet around the top edge of it, right? So you just got that little, you got that little lip of grease, you got that little taste of sort of slipperiness mm -hmm. as you put it on your lip, but then you also put a little nugget of maybe, I don't know, beef dripping or maybe some lamb fat or something, just to float it in the top. Uh-huh. Gee, yum. Um, oh, look at that. Oh, oh. I, I got to say, actually, some of the pork doesn't... The crackling, I, can I tell you guys, I, in fact, do better Carry pork on. crackling than this. I use would a blowtorch. Like like blow Jeff, Here you, you want to come and have it with your red wine? Yeah. Oh, who, sorry, who Jeff's would got like a fairly some? splendid looking burgundy over Come on, Mr. gentleman Hardy. with the broken hand yeah. in the front row, much. come up here. I'll be oh, the guinea pig. Come on, folks. Okay. I'm sure Ewan would probably like some of this as well. Oh, no, <laughs> oh I'm on the wrong side here. Come Very nice. Right. Hi, come on down. We're cooking with fat. Cooking with fat. Join in. Cooking with fat. Join in, eh? So, so what other things in terms of cooking okay. with fat? There you go, kids. What are you Please. doing there? Some. Well, I'm going to fry some bread, but you've got to have lots and lots and lots and lots of lard. Hello, how are you? And we have some forks here. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. For those of you mm -hmm. with mm -hmm. delicate sensibilities. No, sorry, should I have one of those? Jeff. I've got to be nice. Now, unfortunately, unfortunately, the head fell off as we were coming around. It was a little tender. It was a little, a little. Uh, we actually cooked a little bit too much in the cooking with fat oven this morning. Anybody yeah. you recognise, Jeff? <laughs> oh, Jeff. But well, we oh, promised Jeff. to take it home for the kiddies. <laughs> now, you guys also sing the um, our anthem. We, we sing our anthem. You <laughs> sing your anthem. And we believe that now, we'll I haven't sing heard the... this, so would you like to do this? Mm. <laughs> Australians all let us eat fat for breakfast, lunch and tea. Wave golden oils and lard to boil, we'll have a chop or three. Our guts will fill, our beer will swill, our steaks be vast and rare. And then we'll have some more to eat, our monstrous bill of fare. Our stomachs will distend and then we'll blow some mighty air.
This one isn't so bad for you. The crackling isn't too flash. I've got to say, I do a bit of crackling. You've got to get a blowtorch, gentlemen. Yeah. Well, None maybe... of it's too bad for you. Remember that? None of it's too bad so for you. So you're just saying, you know, just let loose, enjoy life. I've got to tell you, I could get used to you guys. This is <laughs> my the theory. Best, the best diet for you is the one you enjoy the most. That's yeah. right. Oh, that's yeah. what cooking with that's fat's right. about. As long as you're right here. Well, people, thank you. Cooking with fat, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Craig Preston and Pat Shield. <laughs> Straightforward suicide or something more?